Meanwhile, the association's general secretary, Jack Sewell, is calling on the Prime Minister, Pete O'Neill, to intervene and address the issue to avoid inconveniences caused to the general public. And I'm prepared to go on strike. Uh, finally, I'm now calling the Prime Minister, uh, Honorable Peter O'Neill, to intervene in this matter. And that's the highest person that I am now calling on. Uh, secondly, I have to call on the Chief Secretary to reprimand John Kelly as he is not performing his duty properly and he cannot listen to his own uh, the, the cries of the, the workforce and they are the public servants of the day. And in doing that, uh, John Kelly should now at the age for his retirement, uh, despite when we are making a move, he has to go. I don't want to see him in, in front of the, uh, on the round table or otherwise the strike will, will be definitely going on without his presence. The Republic of Korea wants to renew and further its bilateral ties with Papua New Guinea. Appointed Ambassador to PNG Kwak Bum Su said this while presenting his letters of credence to Acting Governor General Theodore Zirenwo. Bradley Gregory was at the ceremony and files this report. The members of the disciplinary forces welcome the new Ambassador of the Republic of Korea, Kwak Bum Su, at the government house this morning. Into the house, the proceedings follow on hand to meet the ambassador appointed to the country is head of state, acting Governor General Theodore Zirino. Presenting the letters of credence to the country, Ambassador Bam Su spoke of the growing relations PNG shared with the Republic of Korea. This year marks 40 years of friendship between both countries. Outlined in its new interest with PNG, Korea looks forward to relations in security, economic relations which extend through trade and commerce, and more meaningful is the people-to-people -people friendships. To strengthen ties between our two countries. Acting Governor General Theodore Zurano extended PNG's welcome to the resident representative of the Republic of Korea to PNG. He says PNG values the contribution by Korea over the years. Relations between both countries continues to grow steady as senior officials exchange through big meetings, including APEC and ASEAN meetings, amongst others. Bradley Gregory, NBC National News, Port Mosby.